as you can see, we've already taken the cowling off. This is a Cessna 172 aircraft. And uh, today we're gonna be talking about the vacuum pump on the aircraft. And if you come around here, I'll show you the system. Okay, so the vacuum pump, as you can see, is this black thing right here. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna take air in. It's gonna, um, okay, it's gonna take air in. It's gonna send it through an air filter up into the instruments. And uh, those are called uh, gyros. Okay, so what these gyros are gonna do is they're gonna start spinning up as the vacuum pump is running. And basically, this is what's gonna help with the heading and the attitude. All right, so basically, if that were to fail, this right here is your suction gauge. So your suction gauge is gonna go down to zero. Now your heading and your attitude are not gonna be affected by this right away because those gyros are spinning at such fast speeds that once those speeds slow down, then it's gonna actually start to mess these up. So you have to be uh, cautious of that, but your suction gauge will always go first. Okay. Okay, so for this vacuum pump, this is gonna be a, a, a dry system compared to a wet system. Basically what that means, there's less moving parts in the dry system. Um, you're not gonna need oil, like in the wet system, you're gonna need oil to uh, help lubricate that. You don't need that in the dry system. Here is where you're gonna be able to bleed the air that has been pumped through. So if there's ex excess air, this is what helps get that out. And it just blows into the engine compartment. Um, okay, this uh, bracket piece right here, this is a plastic piece that if, let's say something were to break on your vacuum pump, it's gonna protect, it's two separate things. So this is gonna actually protect the actual engine from causing damage to it. So if this were to break off, this piece right here would actually protect the engine. It's two separate two separate pieces here. Hello, it's Sean Webster again. Um, I just wanted to talk about my experience with uh, Philip and just how we picked the vacuum um, pump system and where his airport is at and just how our whole experience was with that. Um, so me and Philip, we went out to where's hangers at. It's at Rusk International Airport in Henderson. Um, it wasn't too bad. We just went out there for um, an afternoon. And uh, when I met him out there, he uh, basically took the cowling off there in front of me, showed me how, how that worked, and uh, showed me the vacuum pump system underneath of it and just basically walked me through step by step of um, when it all what it all does basically, how the system runs. So when the engine starts up, how the gyro starts spinning and how that affects the instruments. He walked me through that in about 10, 15 minutes. And um, me and my girlfriend just made the video there. Everything went smoothly. Uh, it was actually funny. Me and Philip had never met each other before, but this was the first time. And it was just funny to uh, have him sitting there in front of me watching me as uh, I learned about the system. And now I have to make a presentation. So it, it was good. He's a, he was an awesome guy to have, and he basically showed me how to how to how the vacuum pump worked, and uh, told me that if I ever wanted to go flying, he would help me out. So it turned out to be a great experience, and I'm really glad I did it. And uh, thank you again. See you.